All right, Trey, let's check the next poll. Well, unfortunately, it's time to flip the script. Our next poll to check, who has been this season's most disappointing team? And the people have spoken, 43% voted the Minnesota Timberwolves as this season's most disappointing team. Kind of hard to disagree. I 100% agree with that one. The, we thought the Wolves were going to win 50 games. No, yeah. no one thought uh, that. There were people, Tim Bontemps, definitely, I remember him going on record. Timmy is nuts. Tim Timmy is a said good they were going to win 50 games. He's a smart man, obviously. I, you know, <laughs> That's 50 we thought games. Were, okay, we thought they were going to be a playoff team. No, no. Yeah. no Most uh, people thought did. they were going to be a playoff team. Yeah, yeah I did for sure. sure. I, should, and, I mean... And here they are, because why? Because why? We okay. knew they had some scoring. They got three guys that could put up 20 points per game on any given night in Towns, Zach Levine, and Andrew Wiggins. We thought with Coach Thibodeau coming in there, oh, okay, he'll help the defense. That's all he did in Chicago. Yeah. yeah. He made them into elite defenses. You think Thibodeau with a bunch of young guys that are obviously athletic, you get a system in place and you're going to start picking up some wins. No one thought they would keep getting these massive, massive leads and just keep blowing game after game. So yeah. that's what's shocking. And also, they won 29 games last year and the Rockets made the playoffs with 41. So another 13 wins, assuming 41 or 42 would right. get you in the playoffs. That's part of the reason you did it. But the young talent, they have the defensive-minded uh, Carl Anthony Towns there as well who can go out and score. All the ingredients are there for this team for to sure. be at least 500. But right now, they're well and truly behind that. And, and they have been pretty bad. That being said... It's not that dire because they are getting those leads that you're saying that they're blowing. That's a good sign. I, I, yeah. And yeah, they have the 20 points. I'm not saying... Better than trailing by 20. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. I, I think it's a you, rosy way of looking at it, for sure. I, yeah, I, it's definitely rosy. But yeah. at the same time, I mean, they're, they're looking up at a lot of teams in the standings. But there's lots of hope. Tell and us, I they haven't think, made the playoffs in 13 years. This that, will be 13 That is a ridiculous year. number. Like, they got, they're at a point as a franchise, we got to make the playoffs. They haven't made the playoffs since they went to the conference finals in 04. Well, there you go. Which, I mean, which is crazy. The West is just really good, so I didn't expect them to make the postseason, and their projected line is like 40, which, you know, you, you said... Uh, That's right we, on the fringe based on what we saw last year. Right. And it probably will, if you look at that eight spot right now, yeah. 500 will probably get you that eight spot in the Western Conference. So, so, so who do you think? Teams. Who's the most disappointing team for you, then? <laughs> Off paper, off the court, it's the New York Knicks, just watching them. But I think the Portland Trailblazers, I expected them to be really good this year. Oh, okay. I, I thought they were a surprise team last year when they won 44 games. But I didn't think they'd take a step back. And maybe the second half of the season, like they got going last year, will sort of you know be the same as last year. Because right now, at 18 and 23, I'm shocked. They've got two 20-point scorers in the backcourt, but they can't stop anybody. They've got the third-worst defense in the league. So they have been picking it up. Recently, that's and improved that defense too since Alfa Mina came back. So yeah. it just shows how bad it really was. Yeah, for yeah. Sure. I just thought they were surprised last year, and there'd be no reason for them to step back because mm. the roster didn't get any worse. Evan Turner's signing hasn't worked out, but it doesn't mean they should have gotten worse. Right, right.